Chandrasekhar, shortly called Chandar, lives and works in a ship with his sister Savitri. They are raised by the ship's captain. Now, Chandar becomes busy for Savitri's marriage and fixes in a decent family. Before marriage, Savitri is abducted by Senapati Durji Singh. To save her honor, she kills herself in front of Chandar. Enraged Chandar vows to take revenge on Durjan, but captured by his goons and jailed in a fort, where he meets his long-lost mother. There he learns of his past as he is the son of Mangalsan, who was the faithful chief minister under Maharaja Vikram Singh, who was killed by none other than Durji. To save the prince and princess, Mangalsan took them with him. On the other side his wife took their son and daughter to escape by boats. However, Mangalsan managed to escape while his wife failed and was captured by Durje's goons, leaving her children on the boat, separating them from their parents. Now, Chandar hits upon a plan for meeting his father as well as taking revenge on Durji. However, his mother dies in the jail and Chandar manages to escape. Ends up to be in a ship, which transports him to the arrogant princess Mandakini, who wants Chandar as her slave for lifetime. On the other side, Mangalsan, who now becomes Sardar and trains the villagers, along with Princess Padma and Prince, for fighting against the evils.